What's going on, you bloody legends? We are back at Morton Island. This time I've brought the jet ski. Super keen to get into some fishing. I've also got uh, my new modifications that I've done to the rear end of my Hilux, which I'm super excited to test out and share with you guys. Uh, we finally found a, a campsite. A bit of a delay this morning. We actually got the 8.30 barge. It's now 2.30. And the reason being that the, the gate on the barge had actually broken so we were stuck on there for hours but they finally let us off we're finally here we finally got the spot we're going to get set up because it is quite late maybe keep it pretty low key but i promise you we're going to rip in in the morning you <laughs> you're kidding are you? five days of this let's go radio island time is in full swing we've set up camp Behind me, I've uh, moored the jet ski out there. And uh, yeah, it's, it's getting on. It's probably, you know, late afternoon sort of thing. So we're gonna have a couple of drinks, let the good times flow and rip in in the morning. I'll bring you guys along if anything special happens along the way. Just woken up and the weather is absolutely mint. Have a go at it. So, we're going to jump out on the, out on the ski and uh, head out with Jordan and see if we can get a fish this morning. Have a go at the conditions. Got a cheeky little rainbow peeking out here. Jordan's holding me. Yeah. <laughs> oh, oh. Are you on? Hey! Ooh. Jordan's on here. Tighten up your drag a little bit. No! Good, you're good. Just keep reeling it in. Don't when you drop your rod down, don't let it go loose. <laughs> yeah, Jordan, let's go. So Jordan was telling me his uh, biggest fish the other day was 60 centimeters. So hopefully we can uh, do better than that. Or oh no! We're gonna call it. Uh, we're gonna, I think the camp wants to go for a bit of an adventure, so Jordan's let us down. <laughs> uh, there's, there's plenty. There's plenty of time to get some more fish. So yeah, we'll just uh, pack it up, have some brekkie, and uh, oh, <laughs> oh, we just nearly flipped the ski. Right, a bloody good start to the day already. Have a go at this thing. Oh, on the new setup, got a hot coffee here. Doesn't get much better than this. Day one, started off right. Rightio, so the plan is we're gonna go down to Tangaluma Rex, have a bit of a snorkel, might drop the kayaks out as well, see if we can get some fish, and uh, pull up there for the day, enjoy this sun while we've got it. Set up, pulled up to the tangle in the shoot racks. The time has come. Let's go diving, baby. Boy, that looks evil, eh? Looks like venom. <laughs> How sick is that? That's cool. Let's put it back, eh?
Jordan's been touched up by the reef, trying to get the, the diving shot for me. Under the footage, <laughs> hey, you know what you got to do. My, my man. All right, that was epic, epic little dive session then. We're going to have a little little bit of a bite to eat for lunch and then um, go out on the kayak and um, see if we can get one of those fish. Surely at least one, there's about a thousand of them in there. All right, we're going to head out on the yaks and uh, see if we might be able to get some squid for dinner. Oh, ice cold beer, straight out the esky. Mmm, how bloody good. Oh, bro, something just went that. All right, it's a good sign we're getting hits. Yeah, I'm on. Ah, uh, Flatty. Yeah. Easy, man. Easy turbo. Oh, he's putting flatty juice in me beer. Yeah, first fish of the day. Oh, first fish of the trip. Pretty stoked with that, to be honest. It's a beautiful little flatty. We're going to keep him and uh, and uh, hopefully collectively have a, a feed for the crew. You. This is the little flatty that I caught before. He's 42 centimeters, he measured up at. Um, I'm gonna fill him up now, and uh, I'm gonna have him for dinner tonight. A couple of flathead fillets on a, on a wrap. Alrighty, that's just enough fish for me for dinner tonight. Uh, not bad for one little fish. Good bloody morning to ya. Just woken up. The ski's still here, that's a positive. And there's been a phenomenal amount of bust ups happening in around around camp here. So we're gonna head back out, see if we can grab a fish before we head south this morning. That's the plan. And uh, extra little bonus, there's a couple of dolphins out here just cruising by the ski. So I'm gonna hop in the water now and uh, go retrieve it. way to start the day. <laughs> yeah, I'll be really buzzing if we can get a fish. So many bust ups around here, so hopefully, well, I'm gonna go ahead and assume that they're more tuna, just like yesterday, so chase the bust ups, throw a spinner, and uh, we might do a bit of trolling. All right, there's been a heap of bust ups over here. I don't know if we can manage a fish. Oh, bust ups. Oh yeah, tuna. Oh yeah, come, come. Oh, they're everywhere. They're everywhere, look at them go. Come on, just one. All right, unfortunately no fish. Tried my best chasing those bust ups and casting casting that spinner in there, but we weren't having a bar of it, unfortunately. So that's all good. Not a bad little way to start the day. Gonna um, cook up some breakfast, tee up the crew, and uh, I think we're gonna head south today and check out the south end of the island. Today we're gonna go to the gutter bar for lunch, and on the way we're gonna stop in at the big sand dune and uh, 
have a couple of goes of that. Um, probably pull up for a swim. I really like the southwest coast of Morton Island. It's really beautiful. There's um, just a huge stretch of sand flats and a lot of marine life, so. Looks like the perfect spot for a rip-in sticker. Let's go. Thousands of little soldier crabs along the beach here. <laughs> Look how many there are. Wow. Look at them bury themselves. Funny little creatures. As you spook them, come over the top of them, they just start burying themselves. How cool is that? We just pulled up on the big sand hill. We're grabbing the bodyboards and we're gonna hit it up. I'm super excited. Last time was hell fun. We got the finest equipment available here. The boys are on. <laughs> the beers as well. Let's go. Bit of liquid courage. Who's going first? Yeah, need a bit of courage. Let's go, baby. Yeah. 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 That was crazy! <laughs> oh, it's in the face! Let's see. Let's see the damage. <laughs> oh, lucky, mate. Lucky. Hey, did a barrel roll, but yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Oh, man, that was insane. Yeah, you get so much speed on the way down. You hit the little uh, foot ruts in the sand and they yeah, get you right in the uh, southern gems. Anyway, I think we're going to press on for a pub feed. What do you reckon? Yeah. Oh, oh, oh. I know all that uh, dune climbing has made us pretty peckish, so we're down at the gutter bar, get a feed, have a beer, and uh, kick back. I reckon we might uh, have a bit of a flick out the front at the gutter. Take it easy. Cheers. Look at the size of those prawns. Are you kidding me? They're even bigger. They're insane. Yo, thanks for having us. What happened, mate? Oh, someone 
can't prank very well and <laughs> I figured it out straight away. <laughs> you should have bought a Hilux, mate. You wouldn't have that kind of problem. Imagine that. Zip tie on your drive train. Who would have thought? <laughs> <laughs> Mike's got the idea here. He's got the uh, the Crocs. Yeah, and he's, he's chucked them into off-road there. That's where you put the, the strap over the back. I'm just raw-dogging it. No shoes. There we go, my, my mud boot. <laughs> Look at that, it like peels off. Beautiful as it is out here. I don't think it's the right terrain for mud crabs. I know it's very mangrovey, but there's a lot of algae as well, and the mud just doesn't seem right. It's real soft, it's not thick. Quick hose down at the back of the new rig. Oh, yeah. Perks. Perks of the on tap water solution. Sadly, that's it for this episode, guys. Thank you so much for watching and all your support. If you enjoyed this video, please hit like and subscribe and stay tuned for part two, baby. You! <laughs> it's in the face! Bro, I think you deflated it a bit too much. Uh, ripped in too hard, eh? <laughs> yeah. Pulled everything out with it. The whole Pulled thing's gone flat, out. so that's all right. Lucky they got a bit of compressed air on the on the barge here. Oh well, pretty right. <laughs> Get that on the big jobs. Oh my gosh. Oh.